गुड इवनिंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई एम हियर विथ अनदर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वीडियो सो ऑलरेडी आई हैव मेड अ वीडियो ऑन हाउ टू गेट सेवेंटी आउट ऑफ सेवेंटी इन फिजिक्स एंड हाउ टू गेट सेवेंटी आउट ऑफ सेवेंटी इन केमिस्ट्री बाई स्टडिंग ओनली सिक्स एंड सेवन चैप्टर्स द वीडियो इज लिंक इज गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन इफ यू नॉट सीन दैट फर्स्ट गो थ्रू दैट एंड ऑल्सो हैव मेड अ इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन विथ सोल्यूशन केमिस्ट्री and mathematics that video links are also given in the description please go through that and then come to this one uh, this is that uh, how to get 100 out of 100 in mathematics by studying only seven chapters pu1 mathematics strategy for this year only i am talking about yes let us discuss what are the seven chapters we can study and how to get out about from that see sets relations and functions trigonometry sequence and series straight line limits and derivatives statistics these are the seven chapters you are going to study so using these only seven chapters how can we get out about see in sets so one mcq question you will get one fill in the blanks two two mark questions one three mark questions similar relations function one mcq one two mark one three mark and one five mark trigonometry one mcq one short answer type one mark question two two mark questions one three mark one five mark one six mark question from trigonometry sequence and series one mcq two three mark and one four mark question straight line one one mark mcq one short answer type two two marks one five mark and limits and derivatives one mcq one fill in the blanks two two one two mark question one three mark question one five mark question and one four mark question statistics one short answer type one two mark one five mark question so why i have chosen these only say seven chapters because you see in these seven chapters you can cover six mcqs out of 10 two fill in the blanks question out of 5 and three short answer type question out of 5 5 five out of 5 two mark question six you will get out of 5 three mark question five out of 5 five mark question one out of one six mark question and in four mark question you have to write only one so there i have given two questions any one you know part e belongs to 10 mark question in 10 marks again divided into 6 plus 4 and what i have given here 6 mark question one from trigonometry and one for 4 mark question from either from sequence and series or from limits and derivatives like this you can get out of out how sir see see guys how you can get out of out part a see there mcq out of 10 six question you can answer here from two fill in the blank question see there i were going to answer five questions out of five you will get two questions here and similarly short answer type five questions are there and you can answer three question in part b five out of five part c five out of six you will get part d also five out of five and part e 10 mark question is there in that again 10 is divided into 6 plus 4 and see there six mark question one you will get you can easily write from trigonometry chapter and four mark question either from sequence and series or from statistics that means uh, only studying seven chapters you can get out of out marks guys so this is what a strategy but one note you have to remember here what is a note here read all one mark questions from all the chapters this is a main point you have to study here right i hope this video is useful to you guys if it is useful please comment below and which chapter video you want you could that also you have to comment below guys thanks for watching if a video is helpful to you please like the channel and subscribe the channel and share to your friends so that everybody can get a benefit of it thank you guys thanks for watching